The main objective and the mission of Ramsar is the conservation and wise use of wetlands all over the world. Wetlands include all the beaches, all the coastlines, all the rivers and the streams and peat bogs and swamp peatlands. And people spend most of their holidays in wetlands. And we need to get across that message so people value that which they already think is important but don't necessarily put a cost, a dollar cost, or a loading when they're making decisions about the future. The only convention that is pointed and working on a single ecosystem, wetlands. And it's also unique because it comes before everything else. It's in 1971 that we started, and so it's been over 44 years that the convention has been working. And now we're looking forward to a new strategic plan that starts in 2016, and that will contain elements that go to prevent, stop, and reverse the loss and degradation of wetlands. That's the vision for the future. The convention is formed by its parties, and also the partners that we have, like with IUCN, with whom we share our headquarters here, World Wildlife Fund, BirdLife International, Wetlands International, IWMI, and a number of other important private sector partners like Danone and Evian and Star Alliance. We are very happy to have collaborators who are interested, like us, about different issues on the conventions. So in biodiversity, we have CBD and we work with them on the Aichi targets and they look at our targets and see how we can achieve those mutually. Same with CMS or CITES. We have uh, UNCCD and that is a, a convention where we are actually in alliance to see how we can look at wetland loss and dryland loss, how we can recreate to restore degraded land. There are many good examples. If we just look at Latin America now, Mexico has very keenly, actually almost as many sites as the largest number in the world. They have over 142 Ramsar sites. We see great prospect and hope and scope for greater collaboration in the future because the Convention on Wetlands is not a convention just about biodiversity or just about farming. It's about disaster risk reduction. It's about livelihoods. It's about carbon. It's about how people can survive and have their water for cooking and for washing and for eating and enjoying, the value of water for culture and the multiple uses that we put to wetlands.